Hey guys, it's Spacey Sims, and we are back with an another installment of The Sims for Building New Crest Challenge, the Pendragon Legacy. I have no idea what that was about. She just walked in the house and got all spooked. Um, she is so ticked off right now. Look at her face. Oh my god, she like hates the world. She has four days till she is an elder, and Romeo has six days until he is a young adult, and we can move on to Generation 4. Um, so, of course, we did it in the last part. Hi. Can you clean this for me? Because I don't, I don't know what Sophia is doing here, but anyway. Um, is she a teenager? We don't know what she is. I think she's still a teenager. But anyway, you should come over here and... Uh, no, not... I was trying to click on her. Uh, friendly introduction. Yeah, that's nice. Um, so go introduce yourself to this young lady. Uh, I think, did, um, did Sebastian age up in the last part? Because, yeah. He's kind of got the Arthur Pendragon face. Yeah. He's got a little more of Sergio, I think, in him. Uh, but he's got the same mouth, jaw, and everything that, like, uh... Discuss latest games. She's feeling flirty. Is he viewing a candlestick? Um, ask her about her career. I don't know. I think she's a teenager, but I don't know, because... Ask her about her day. More choices. Romance. Can we flirt with her a little bit? She's an author at Walrus Books. Oh, dear God, like his mother. <laughs> oh, she did not like that. Is she like a... I don't know what she is. Like, it doesn't tell you what she is. Oh, she's a young adult now. Never mind. I thought maybe she was like a teenager still. Uh, it would figure that she's not because... Yeah, you know what I mean? Like... Get to know. He feels awkward. He's like all sorts of rainbow colors. He's bored. He's inspired from a shower. He's feeling energized. And he's happy slash focused from decor. Interesting. Um, yeah, but anyway. So, go in there. You are still at level 8, and I'm not even concerned at this point because it's killing me trying to get you to the top of a career. Um, so, as we obviously did in the last part, we made it short lifespan. I'm not too concerned. We'll send her to work and do whatever. We'll just see where she gets before she dies. Um, I'm going to let her keep working, I think, until she dies. Um, but as soon as Romeo ages up to a young adult, we're moving on. And I did place a house down. Um, it's actually not here. I think it's over a house that will on a lot that will eventually be the gym. So I don't know if I'm going to take that house and then convert it to a gym or if I'm going to, like, then just place a gym down. Because, you know, obviously, like, what I really liked about the challenge when I started it was the fact that, you know... It's supposed to help you, like, you know, I can build things and do a library and do this, but I'm like, I'm so terrible at building, and I have no inspiration at the moment right now to, like, want to do that. So, <laughs> I'm like, eh, I'm not worried about it. If I obviously get inspired to, like, want to build something, maybe I will actually build my own gym or whatever. Um, but I definitely want it to be, like, a gym and a spa kind of a thing combined, so when we get there... I don't know if, yeah, I'll just find something to place down on that lot or whatnot, so, yeah. So that's what we'll do. Um, but then this way we can still kind of play with the family, and we're still going with the building up new crest, and when we're done we'll have a nice little new crest that has all sorts of lots and stuff all over it, but obviously, you know, some of them I will have built, because I built the original ones, but I'm not building the later ones, probably. Especially because when we get to, like, the really, like, the mansion houses, ugh. No way can I build that. <laughs> like, oh my god. No way do I really. I feel like traumatized already thinking about it. Sometimes I get in the mode of really wanting to build, and then other times I just. I don't know. Like, I just can't manage it, I guess, is what I should say. Like, so. He wants to. What is this? Lock a door? 
lock a door, and he wants to collect a new element. Okay, bird, that's my headset. You can't click on it. Um, well, he has an A, though, so that's good. So at least we can start him when he gets a job. Uh, when he gets to the athletic career, he'll get at level three. So, I mean, because that's kind of what we want to do. We want to see how far we can get. We still obviously want to go to work and all of that stuff, but... Yeah. I should get going now. Do we have any plants in our family inventory? Like, did Arthur, like... Get snapdragons? Or dragon fruit, I mean? Because... Were there no strawberries around here? Like, what kind of plants do we have over here? Oh, yes, we had a nice tip that gardeners will not take care of these unless they are in, like, the square planter boxes. So, yeah. Oh, yes, because there's... Those are dragon fruits. Um, Are you awake? Why don't you come here and visit the park? Uh, just go by yourself. I want you to visit the park because I want you to harvest all this. <laughs> I mean, I really feel like we should, like, come back to the park every once in a while and, like, tend our own plant garden. Um, so we're probably going to have to just rearrange how we do this or just deal with our plants dying. I don't know. I'm not sure if I care. I think when we came to the park the last time when the kids were kids um, and Sergio brought them to the park that there was a gardener who showed up. So, I mean, I don't know if he would have done anything because Sergio or Romeo or one of the kids, stupid bird, is in the kitchen again because he's a jerk and he's mad that I'm not paying attention to him and he's being a petulant little child. Oh, let's go harvest everything. Um, so go harvest everything because, you know, if we have some, uh, we might need these dragon fruits uh, because, hello, they're worth lots of money. Especially if they're a perfect plant. So we can get lots of money if we sell them at home. And why don't you actually spray for bugs? And you can't evolve anything. So why don't we, while we're here, it really sucks because I don't want to put the square planters down because I like the way our plants line the walkway, but I guess it's better to just put the square planters down. So let's actually go into buy mode. Um, let's actually just do that so that the gardener will actually come. So let's see if we have, do we have them in here? We don't. So let's do the, I hate when I just, I really hate my build mode, but I really hate the second if I go to try to search for something and the second I type one letter, that's it. Uh, planter box. That's what I want. Uh, so we have to use these square ones, I guess. So let's just, we can put one here, we can put one here, we can put one there, and then we can put one here, that one will have to move, and then we'll put one here, I guess, um, and we just won't have plants particularly lining our walkway, so we'll just put that in there, we'll put this in here, we can put these ones over in here. We can put this one here, this one here, we can put that one there, we can put these ones here. They don't have to be totally filled, you know what I'm saying? Like, we'll just kind of, uh... Put this one here. Actually, no, they do have to kind of be filled because we're going to put our trees in this one. So let's put these here. Oh, that's perfect! Oh my god, look at that, we're so perfect. Uh, so yeah, because these are our trees that we have to leave, so let's actually bring these down closer to the entrance. We'll put these ones kind of in between these lights, I guess. Maybe we'll put them closer to the walkway. You know, this way it kind of makes it at least looks like something. And then we can put... I feel like we should put this one here. Yeah, but then that one's not gonna... That's okay, we don't need, maybe we don't need to put that one over there. Maybe we can just put this one over here. You know? Um, we don't have to have one on that side. It'll look a little lopsided and wonky, but, I mean. Just because that one's across from the walkway. Otherwise, this one would have to be here. And then this one would have to be here. I guess that's fine. That's fine. Um... 
There we go. As long as we harvested everything. And oh, now we can evolve things. Weird. So now maybe a gardener will show up and take care of our plants. Um, and we'll just finish tending our garden until a gardener shows up. But that's lovely. So now maybe a gardener will come and take care of our plants for us. Uh, so we don't have to worry about them dying and getting covered in bugs. And there are imaginary people walking by. Do you see this? They're freaking zombies. Um... There are zombies walking by because they're just thought bubbles. So let's see. Who's this lady? Piper Navarro. So Piper, are you like a... Can we come over here and give her a friendly introduction? Is she... And there's a hobo. Cool. She could be cute. She's at... If you look... She actually looks like she might be cute. Oh, of course, she's yellow. <laughs> uh, we might have to change that because I'm just like, oh, my God. With my My Little Pony Sims, all of them are yellow and it drives me bonkers. She looks like she could be a teenager. Oh, she's an adult. Damn it. Oh, she looked like she could be a teenager. We don't want an adult. Dang it. And these are all like kid kid. Who's this kid? Tom Strauss. Are there any like, these are all dudes. I don't have any female children. Are there any female uh, teens over here? Who's this? Phoenix Ragsdale. Let's come over and say hi to Phoenix. She's she's kind of cute. Or not. Or not. Or not. Uh, okay, somebody's having a baby. Uh, that's just how my game behaves. Allison Harrison. Friendly introduction, so let's check out Allison. <laughs> Allison's super cute. She's really cute. She's cuter when she laughs, but that's okay. I think she's cuter than Phoenix, but... Well, uh, friendly introduction to her. And who's this? She's an adult. And we don't know what Peyton is, but I'm assuming Peyton's not a teenager. She doesn't really look like a teenager, but I can't tell. Okay, so let's, um, he's tense because he needs athletic. Okay, so why don't you, uh, actions, can we just exercise, do push-ups, there you go, because you need activity, physical activity, you need exercise, there we go, and then you should go over to her and discuss latest games, ask her about her day, hey, stop, stop, no, 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 don't you stargaze with that boy. No. She's our puzzle. Oh, who's this chick? Oh, 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 oh. Who is she? Who's this girl? We got a new girl over here. Whoa. She's a clown. That's what she does for a living. Ren Blackman. Ooh, I actually like her name. She could be cute, minus the garish hooker makeup. Like... Mm, Ren's cute. Friendly introduction. Stop talking to the hobo kid! Oh, I don't know. Ren's cute, and, uh... Oh, my lord. Hamburger Man! Oh, my god, game. If you could stop being such a glitch. Ren's cute, but Allison is cute, too. Oh, hmm. Oh, that's that lady that we know. Who's this dude? Curtis. Oh, we don't care about Curtis. We know Curtis already. I don't know. Could you actually introduce yourself to her like I asked you to do? For God's sakes. I love the fact that it's Thursday at 4 o'clock in the morning and they're all hanging out here. He's really hungry. And he's really tired. Could you introduce yourself to her? Um... More choices, friendly. She's leaving, but we got to we at least asked her. Okay. You know what? Just go home because you're driving me bonkers now. Okay. Stop chatting. Uh, so we got some teenage girls. Yay. Uh, I like Allison and Ren. Phoenix is okay. I like her name, but. Ren Blackman. I almost. Again. <laughs> Uh, like in the alternate realities, we ran into the 
girl's last name it was Mondragon, but I keep calling her Moon Dragon because I'm like I'm adding an extra O, so <gasps> I want to add an extra O in Ren's name and make her Ren Black Moon. <laughs> Ren Black Moon marries the Pen Dragons. I love that. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And her pretty tan skin with the red hair that'd be fabulous. It's gonna look a little crazy though if. We uh, marry uh, Allison. <laughs> like, uh, oh, hey, who's this girl? No, oh, Snorka. Suzanne Quick. Let's uh, friendly introduce to her. Is she a teenager or is she a young adult? She's probably a young adult or adult. She looks more older. She looks more older. What's her name? Uh huh. Suzanne Quick. Okay, I read that totally wrong. No, Lisa. Okay, so why don't you go eat and then go to bed, because you're actually really tired. Um, we'll actually see... He's got to go to school. And he's exhausted. Um, I... I was actually... No, this is where I wanted to be. She... Oh, this is Marcus... Flex is married to Suzanne Quick. I don't know why that sounds amusing to me, but... Okay, so... We're, we're not going to keep chatting with her. We don't want Marcus to kick our butt. So get something to eat, and then you're going to have to, like, I'll take these for your family, or a bunch of slobs. Uh, I seriously saw what's-his-face in the background there, Sebastian, and I was like, who the hell is that guy? It's, that is Sebastian, right? I can't remember their names all of a sudden. <laughs> oh my god, my brain is broken. Um, yeah. So, that's awesome. We gotta work on finding a... We gotta have him... When he goes to school, we're gonna have him get to know people. No! 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 Put those down! Put those down! Put it on! Put it on! I know you have a dishwasher, but if you could just keep being slobs, that'd be great. Um, You poor thing. You're supposed to... You're gonna go... You need to take a nap. Not play on the computer. He needs... Do you have reward store? Let's get a sleep replacement potion for you. I know your mother has one. Let's get one. And let's drink this before you go to school. Let's drink that. Don't drink coffee. Drink your sleep replacement. So I eat coffee. That's how the most of us function. Perfect. Now you're ready for school and you're not exhausted. Good job. Bye. Um, can you make friends? And can you go to school? Okay, you're going to school too. And let's see. Um, who? Pause, 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 pause. That's Ava. She's walking around in the, with a sassy walk in a... Could you throw that away, please? Why would you? Will you go to bed? I'm pretty sure. No. Stupid. You need to go to bed. Sleep. Go to sleep. So you need to go to sleep because you have three hours before work and you're freaking exhausted. Um, Study the heart test, I guess. Sleep. Jesus. Cheese and rice, girl. Blah, 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 blah. Romeo met Clay. Okay. Oh, girl, get up and go to work. Who cares if you're late to work, honestly? I really don't. <laughs> I really do not. I could care the less just because. Ignore the petition. Because last time we did this... Online petition fans are irritated at first and then completely forget it ever happened. Meanwhile, Guinevere invents a new character that could be even more popular than the first. Yeah, because last time I did it and it was like, everybody whined and cried. So, and she had a performance loss, but she doesn't get a performance gain for good stuff. Why did you only meet boys? Let's uh, invite her to hang out a current lot. 
And then let's invite her to hang out at current lot. So forget your homework. You're already an A student. Um, we need to get some ladies over. Ren will be black over. Black over. <laughs> I was reading her last name. Ren will be black over. Ren will be right over. And Allison Hairston will be right over. I mean, Ren wins name-wise, but... So let's um, debate game strategy. Let's uh, invite her in. Monkey around with her. Let's see. Um, she's really pretty. Mm. It'd be really terrible if we didn't... Uh, Get the red hair and the green eyes, though. Hmm. I really want to see her without the terrible makeup on. Well, I got an idea. Let's see something. More choices. Friendly. Can we ask to see outfit? Let's ask to see her swimwear. Hey, what's your bathing suit look like? I think it's weird that you can ask some... Oh, she does not like Allison. She is like, you are not good enough for my brother. She's really snooty. Why don't you uh, clean that up for me and then go to bed? No. Okay, good. Um, more choices, friendly. Can we get to know her? Get to know. Get to know. Uh, I told him to get to know her, and he just walked away from me. I want you to get to know her a little bit, uh, a couple of times, because hopefully we can get all of her traits that way. Get to know her. <sighs> Monkey around. She's a goofball. I like that. Give props. And she loves the outdoors. Huh. That could work. What's about... Where's the other girl? Where'd what's-her-face go? Where... Where is she? Is she on her computer? Because that's rude. Toad's rude, girlfriend! Toad's rude. More choices. Friendly. He's totally bored about the other girl. More choices. Get to know. Get to know. Uh, discuss latest games. I don't know. She's now angry at him, so she's not working out so well for an option, because she's... Yeah, I don't think they get along really well. He does not get along with Ren. Even though, I mean, I don't know, his relationship with her is, like, really crappy. Oh, now they're, like, enemies. Oh, now she's a young adult? What the frick? She was just a teenager. <sighs> Oh, she hates children. All right, well, and bye. Bye, Felicia. More choices. Bye. Bye, Felicia. Um, I'm going to have to find him a, a woman to slap in the town because there's no good ladies in the town because he was getting along with her, but she's a young adult and she hates children, so bye 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 <gasps> Bye bye Get out of my house. And Ren kind of hates him, so we got nothing. We got nothing. It was like, yay, we met all these young adult, these teenagers last night. That's so great. And now we got nothing. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I should really get going now. Yeah, you really should. Uh... Because, and there's nobody prowling around town. And we're not allowed to leave Newcrest. Do, yeah, no. And we know nobody because we don't meet any other ladies at school. My game hates me. <laughs> um, pause, who's this lady? She's probably not a teenager. She's an adult. Yeah. All right. Well, that, there goes that. So the only girl that was a teen that we kind of sort of liked is a jerk. And, uh, can you scavenge for parts? 
do 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 um you know what's really funny we have never had our ghosts come out these guys have never come out hannah and ulysses are still here but they have never come out of their urns weird okay i don't know arthur used to come out ulysses just refuses to come out so I wish we'd had the no call mod or, well, you know, the one that I have, the whatever one. Yeah, you need to, I know you want to do your homework, but everybody else in their house is sleeping. You were the only person who was awake. Um, yeah, it's disappointing. I don't know what to do, man. Oh, well. Uh, there's a rumor coming around. There's a crazy party happening right now. Care to join me? Uh, Yes. I know we're not supposed to travel outside of Newcrest. Um, it's part of the rules, but we know that I don't follow the rules, really, ever. 100%. So we're going to Newcrest, because we're going to go to this party, even though we only have a few minutes left. Um, but I just really want to see, maybe there'll be other, like, teenagers or something, or other ladies, because good lord, game. It's like... <sighs> yeah, you need kids in your town? There's no kids. I need teenage girls in my town? None. Oh. That was the one nice thing about the go to school mod is uh there was always like kids in town. Who's that? That's an adult dude, I think. Uh there's Candy, but she's old. And you know, I don't know, so let's There is like nobody here. That was weird. That disappeared for a second. Um, his hygiene is really crappy, but I think it's funny. It's a Thursday night, but there's nobody here still. So, okay, let's fast forward through this a little bit and see if we can get some other people here. I mean, there's Candy, but she's like an adult. So it's like, good Lord, who's this girl? Let's uh, give her a friendly introduction. Let's see if she's cute. He's bored. He hates everyone because he's bored by everything. Let's see, let's check her out. I mean, aside from her unibrow. I mean, she, okay, it's not unibrow, but she almost looks like a unibrow. Uh, her eyebrows almost look like a unibrow. It's quite ridiculous. She's alright. She's not like... She could be pretty though. Ooh, who's this girl coming up? Let's, uh, call her over. Hey, Hotness, who's you? Let's give her a friendly introduction. She's all mad. Hey, I know she's a young adult, but, I mean, aside from the green freckles, what is with the green freckles? That's some poor makeup choices. You had a bit of an accident. I'm not sure why her freckles are green. Um, but she is actually super duper cute. Uh, she's a young adult though, which kind of stinks, but... Um, get to know. Get to know. So just fun activities. We can, um... Order food. Grab chips because they're free. She's good. Okay, that's nice. And lazy. Uh, Alright, I mean, that's not really going to work for him since he's active, but I think he can survive. I mean, she's really, like, so far our only option because we don't know any other teenage girls. She's a little bit older than us, but... I mean, we just got to keep our eye out. He is going to have a hard time finding a lady and starting his legacy because... Ain't nobody in town. There's no ladies in town. I was really hoping more people would show up to this party. This is kind of lame. I mean, it could be worse. It could be like a party that I would have when like nobody's there. It's just me. Yay, all by myself. Oh, 
Story of my family. Oh, that's a page of my dress. Shabini. So is this party over yet? Because it's kind of boring. Okay, can you go pee by any chance? I guess you have to go pee in a bush. So. Yeah, he's like, man, not much going on here. I'm gonna go pee in a bush. I'm probably gonna run to the furthest bush possible away. It seems like it. Hey, at least he's wandering the maze. Jumped in the bush. Taking a leak. Um, I almost want to send him home right now. I'm really hoping the party ends soon. Um, but yeah, I mean, so nobody showed up. I was really kind of hoping maybe there would be more people for him to mingle with and get to know, but... <laughs> You know, not so much, so... I don't know. He's also stanky, so... It's not gonna help. It's not gonna help anybody. If he meets anyone, he's gonna be, like, offending them with his... stench. So yeah, I mean... Who's this lady? She's an adult, we don't want to talk to her. Uh, yeah, okay, so, oh goody, the party's over, let's go home. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna send him home, and I'll have him take a shower, um, but yeah, so I will wrap this part up here, I will see you guys next time, remember to give the video a big thumbs up, and subscribe to see more!